had to wait three years for this day. Had your reservations for Hawaii back in 2020 and had to cancel them because it was postponed and they made them again last year and then had to cancel and postpone again. So finally, we have made it to the finish line. Yes. As you probably know, Sarah, you know, she is an incredible human being, very humble. She would bend over backwards for, for anybody and do anything for anybody. So, gotta love her to death for that. I brought my trumpet in and I'm gonna practice and man, I heard a saxophone. And I said, man, I hate to interrupt this person, but I have to meet this person. His first impression on me was just, I just heard something in his playing. I just heard a, a passion. And the moment that door opened, my life changed. Finding love is not a simple task, and it's more of a challenge when you are never in the same place for more than a week at a time, like our schedules. And connecting with somebody who wants to tolerate your crazy life is very rare, but somehow Sarah's stars aligned with Jason's and they found themselves on a world's worth of a love journey. Babies, moving, new jobs, multiple tours, and not even a global pandemic could stop these two from choosing each other. I have never met a couple more passionate for their craft, and it's very inspiring to watch how they make it happen and they share in that desire. We met in Australia and had the time of our lives. After all the fun and crazy times we experienced, I knew you were the one when you were cool reading classic novels aloud to each other. It's those type of things that really are the sexiest. I'd be lying if I said it was an easy road with our relationship, but I'm so glad we stuck it through and made it happen because we sure as hell make some beautiful children and I know we are astastic parents. I vow to never stop learning you and your soul. I vow to never stop supporting your growth and desires. I have out a hold space for the understanding, compassion, and grace that is needed for our love to expand. I promise to always lift you up and keep your spirits high, to be your rock, your comedian, your soulmate, that guy. I vow to say sorry when I mess up, and I vow to show you grace and forgiveness when you do. We're in this human experience together, and however that looks like now and all throughout the years, I vow to walk through it with you by my side. My life is fuller, richer, and filled with more love than I ever could have imagined. The best is yet to come. I love you, Jason Miguel. I do pronounce you cat's husband and wife. You may not kiss the bride, but hey. sister right and your great dad and your great mom Sarah I'm so excited for you guys future together you guys are gonna be some awesome parents raise a great family Jason I am very proud of you and uh, I'm glad you're a part of the family
Music is my mistress, and now the time has come to put her in the back seat and sit you shotgun. I love you, Sarah. <laughs>